Hi, and welcome to the channel. My name is Tony, and in today's video, I'm going to do a quick down and dirty tutorial on how to remove blocked external IP addresses from Synology after several failed login attempts. If this is your first time with us, please consider subscribing to the channel and hit that little bell so that you're alerted to when I release new content. So last week I was working with my buddy James Cole on his Unbridled Emotions podcast. We work and record at his house, but I like to do the editing here at my house. So I set up my Synology NAS so that I could access it remotely and upload the recorded files to a shared folder. That being said, I accidentally locked myself out because I miskeyed the password several times. That prompted the idea for today's video, so I'm going to show you how to get around this and unblock that external IP address. That being said, let's head over to the DSM and I'll show you how quick and easy it is to get this accomplished. So the first thing you have to do is click on the control panel, then come over to the security tab. Across the top, let's click on the account tab and here's the auto block section. Now I have the login attempt set to five within a five minute period. So if I log in incorrectly more than five times, I'm gonna get locked out of my Synology NAS. And that's exactly what happened. So here's what we have to do. We're gonna come down to allow block list and we'll click on block list. And you can see here's the IP address that was blocked, the date and time it was blocked, the duration for how long it's blocked and the location where the IP address resides. So simply to unblock the address, select it, click remove, and then click delete. So now the next time I go over to James's house to work on the podcast, I should be able to upload the Audacity files from his house to my house via the Synology NAS. If you found any value in today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to check out some of my other videos up above. Please remember to subscribe, like, and share the video. And thank you guys for using my Amazon affiliate links. I know they don't change your price, but they do help out the channel. My name is Tony with Quick Tech Solutions as always. Please stay safe. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.